It's what endows other particles, even itself actually, with mass. Interesting. Now, where does, where does that come from? Well, just to take Neil's idea, it starts with the idea of a field. That's how you right. get rid of this idea of action at a distance. You imagine that space is filled with stuff. You don't invent the fields? Uh, I, I really don't. Michael Faraday. Yeah. Oh, really? He, well, that makes sense. He was yeah. the first. Yeah. Well, to they think, think, and, and right. think what, a, what a leap that is. Yeah, that is. Right. Yeah. It's right. an insane leap. Right. They take it for like granted there. there's nothing right. there. Yeah. You're looking you know? at nothing. You're seeing and yet nothing. And you're positing you're, that there is something yeah, there. Yeah, 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 and that, okay. that's an amazing thing. But he was talking electric and magnetic fields. Right. What Higgs is talking about is a new field called the Higgs field, which he didn't call it that, but that's what we call it. So it's this feel that fills space and as particles that otherwise would be massless, as they try to go through space, they have to burrow through the Higgs, Higgs field. field. Okay. And that creates a kind of drag force on them, which is what imparts the mass that they have. Okay. And that's the field.